Hi, Chris here for Tanker Tech. Well, today we are going to do the unpacking of the modular power supply from EVGA. This series is a Supernova 750 80 plus gold. So, let's get started now. So, let's get uh, the packaging uh, cut open. Alright, and uh, open this box. Uh, just uh, for your information, uh, at the start soon, I will uh, slow, uh, slow down sorry, the video like this. If you want to pause, you can uh, read through what's written on the box. But all the details are in the command, comments sorry, down below. Right? So feel free to go there as well. You will have much more details than uh, if you try to pause and read them. All right? Uh, as you can see, the 80 plus gold here, they say that it's 90%, all right? However, those 90% is for 115 volt only, all right? For 220 volt, uh, it will be 92%. So you have all the quiet fan uh, with the dynamic uh, bearing, all right? Uh, then you have the uh, temperature here, as you can see, up to 50 degrees. I like most of the cheap uh, power supply. Let me uh, show you the back now. I'll do a close up and uh, slow it down a little bit if you want to read. But as I, did, as I did say, this is just an unpacking. All right. For the review, I will do that another day. The reason I went with this uh, PSU, it's because he has been strongly recommended by many people. And uh, nowadays, you don't need that much more. All right. Okay, so once I manage to open this box, uh, we can open it and start to look at what is inside, finally. Yeah, okay, and there is, ah, oh, I thought so, I thought so, really. Now, okay, yep, not bad. <laughs> so, the first things we will see once we open the box is the manual, alright. Uh, there will be not too thick compared to others but I'm sure uh, it will be well detailed uh, as you can see here uh, and uh, you have more details than what most of them will have anyway uh, they just put uh, more languages so this is uh, things to do and do not right and yeah you still have other languages but uh, it's not a big deal Okay, uh, let's get this out of the way and uh, take this out. So, out of the box, like so. You can see that the foam is minimalist. I like it, it protects well. But uh, let's throw that away anyway. Uh, the box is, uh, well, PSU is well preserved. Put it on the side and see what's inside there. So, this is the, the floppy disk. Alright, nobody uses those anymore, but uh, anyway, uh, just in case you want them, you have them. Those, are, that's the nifty features, uh, who comes with all the harnesses, you can reuse this for the cable management. The next cable will be the, uh, alright, this is for the graphic card, okay. Uh, you have two of those, alright. Uh, this is uh, the uh, Molex uh, connector. Yep, uh, uh, I believe you have six of those. Uh, this is uh, the power from the wall uh, to the PSU, uh, UK plug, of course, for us here. And next, uh, yes, this is nice. This will allow you uh, to use and test your uh, PSU or to uh, refill your. Uh, water cooling pump uh, may you have uh, one right you just make the ground connection and then you start the PSU okay uh, those oh my gosh yeah I was afraid of that look at the color for black theme everything is black all right they did a very good job but the screw wow oh, well anyway uh, next uh, on the line it's uh, uh, the uh, SATA connectors 
and this should be the CPU. Let's see. Uh, yeah, that's correct. That's for the CPU. Uh, you have uh, two times uh, four per cable, and you have two cables, which means that you can do uh, two times eight. So, uh, nothing else in the box, so uh, we can uh, close this and uh, put it well. Uh, arrange it. And like this, we can see what was in the box a little bit better. Not to worry, I didn't forget the star of the show to open the PSU. Yep, I did not forget. And soon it will be open like so. Yeah, okay. Let's take this out and have a look at that. I really cannot, uh, uh, cannot take it, so I have to show it again. There it is! <laughs> whatever man anyway uh, as you can see this is a silent fan which means that if it's not required it would not start it will not start so not to worry about that all right uh, here you have uh, uh, the ratings okay you can pause if you want to uh, but i have the details down below as i was saying and as you can see uh, the ambient maximum temperature maximum load sorry is at 50 degrees celsius and like the cheap one uh, here for the connection at, uh, this one is uh, fully modular uh, you can see that uh, everything is uh, well explained all right um, so i will show you now uh, how it works but first let me uh, yep you have here the on off and what was important to me to point out is that it's automatic it will adjust itself doesn't matter if you have uh, 100 or 220 volt okay so now uh, let's try to plug in a wire to show you uh, how uh, it does okay so uh, let's make a little bit of space here okay right so I'm not too good at it, but uh, as you can see, uh, it goes only one way, which is good for me. Okay, so you just have simply uh, to align it and uh, push it downwards and you should hear a click like so. Okay, that is done. Uh, not too bad, isn't it? Uh, so this one, it's uh, the height pin, okay, for uh, the CPU, this one. You can see that uh, for this particular uh, PSU, they do not click together, some of them will, but once you put it in the plug, there is no, no problem at all. I will also be using uh, this other one, because I need an 8 and a 4 pin, okay? Uh, so, uh, this one goes into uh, the CPU and this one uh, into the motherboard, and that's about it. The next one, it's uh, the one we don't use, which is uh, uh, Molex collector to uh, floppy disk okay but uh, you have it so why not i'm not even sure if you guys have heard of uh, floppy disk uh, anyway uh, let's continue uh, with uh, the process okay uh, so then i just have to plug in uh, the power there and uh, normally uh, i can start and check so to remove as you can see once they are in oops <laughs> once they are in it's uh, pretty tough to remove them they are well uh, fitted there. and yes i forget to show you the 24 pin connector this goes to the psu okay uh, down there right and uh, the other side can you see it yes uh, this one the one with uh, uniform goes to uh, the motherboard okay uh, that's it about uh, this unboxing so now i will put uh, everything uh, on display all right and uh, after that uh, there will be a b-roll just uh, before uh, the hand credits okay uh, so um, thank you for watching until here if, if you did uh, you are very very good uh, and if you like this video which i hope so if you're staying till now uh, please uh, do uh, press the like button you can even subscribe if you wish to if you do not like it, however, I would uh, love you to uh, tell me why in the comments uh, you did not like it. It will help me to improve, hopefully. Uh, it won't be your last time uh, on this channel. I'm trying uh, to learn 
and uh, I would be glad if you could help. Uh, so that's about it now and uh, thank you very much. Uh, bye now guys.